Hey guys, uh, this is Snack Tech 8. Welcome to part 17 of, um, let's play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Um, we're gonna get that treasure chest. <laughs> I just realized <laughs> this game is gonna take me quite a long time. Um, although it's not as long as some of the, uh, other Zelda games. Oh wow, a blue rupee, that's great. Oops. Oh, I'm gonna die. Although it's not quite as long as some of the other Zelda games, um, I realized that, uh, at this point, video number 17, I was, like, more, well more than halfway done with World of Koo, and that took me, like, I don't know, a couple months. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Probably gonna take a long time, but, uh, oh my god, it's a dragonfly. Oh, dodged him. Can we Deku this guy? Yeah, you just got decooed. Um, which is what I'm gonna say from now on when I drop a Deku uh, nut slash bomb on somebody. Get over here! Oh, come on! Got him. Um, so yeah, get ready for that. <laughs> it's happening. See, I'm, I'm about to do it again. Oh, oh, oh! Just got decooed. Alright. <laughs> um, oh, this looks promising. Oh, I don't know what's in here. Hopefully it's something good. It's a heart piece. Always great. I only need one more now, and I will have another heart container. And there's a chest over there, which I see and I'm going to get now. Um, so yeah, part 17. I don't know, finishing this, uh, first temple will probably make me feel a little better about how long this is going to take. And I'm finishing it today. These videos will probably all be uploaded in, like, three weeks, though. Um, since I'm actually going on vacation again on, uh, Tuesday of the... Well, I don't even know when this will be up, but <laughs> if it's up before Tuesday, um, let's see, it's today the 6th. So then, uh, it will be up before the, if this is up before the 11th, that's when I'm leaving. <laughs> wow, okay. Maybe not the most interesting topic to bring up while doing a Let's Play. I'm running low on magic power, too. Which is bad. Because I can't, that means I can't shoot any more bubbles. Or do the spin slash, but I never really do that anyway. Good thing I can deku people. You just got deku by the way. Um, <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I always want to use the shield there. Yeah, he has this little shield, it's like a nut. It's cool, I haven't used it so far, because, I mean, there's really, there's not that much use, there's never really been that much use for the shield in the Zelda games. Oh well, it's cool. Um, I don't know the song. Yeah, here it is, I got it. Oh, that was all memory right there. Awesome. I knew it started with up left. And, uh... <laughs> it's kind of sad that I've memorized the Ocarina tunes, but whatever. Oh, and there's this thing rising out of the swamp. What could it be? Ah! Although you're probably all expecting this anyway, but whatever. Let's... Hop in our flower and fly on over. Oh, he's kicking. He's kicking. He's not going to make it. He's not going to make it. Oh, he made it. Alright, so this is Woodfall Temple. First temple of the game. There's a fairy. I don't really care about that, though. Alright, and there's a fairy that I actually do care about. I don't know what this thing is. I think that's like the teleporter back to the beginning. We don't need to use that because we're already at the beginning. Let me get rid of these things. What are these called? Black bow. Calm down and attack it. There's a lot of them, but that's all. I'm guessing they don't give me much. I want magic power. Maybe I can cut down these grasses. Yeah, there we go. Alright, let's get to business.
So yeah, I'm powering through this, uh, this temple. It's actually the first time I've had to do a power through because in World of Goo is like, you can do one level and pretty much the video's over. Got him. Found a stray fairy. This is your first one. Um, from what I can remember, the stray fairies in this temple are fairly easy. I think I'll probably be able to find all of them without having to resort to mask and or guide walkthrough, whatever. Which I haven't used yet. I haven't used a walkthrough. This is all memory and dumb luck. Now, I don't know if I can shoot those down yet. I'll try it though. No. Oh yeah, I can. What came out of that? Blue rupee. Kind of a waste of my time, but okay. Yeah. Alright. So yeah, there's a lot of fly... Nah. <laughs> I swallowed my tongue. There's a lot of flower flying in this dungeon. There's a chest. Hopefully it's something that'll do good. Oh, fairy. Um, my advice to, uh, some of you who haven't already played this, uh, fairies are in any place. Like, you, if you want to find them all and you don't, like, want to use a guide or anything, um, especially in the later temples, you really gotta scour the whole place. Oh, that was not cool. There we go. That bubble just does humongous damage to him. Like, it takes two hits to kill with a sword, but one, one little bubble blast is enough. Alright. Oh, I'm, I'm getting close to the end of the video, but whatever. Oh, that stench. This place stinks like that poison swamp. Again, there's poison water on the ground. Oh, that was not cool. There we go. Deku stick. Yeah, I don't think there's anything down there. Let's go this way. I could probably change to normal Link now, but whatever. Got him. Oh, there's a stray fairy in that guy. See, they're even in enemies all over the place. And I'm pretty sure these things close if I'm not Deku Link. And I get hurt by the poisoned water anyway. So I guess I'll just stay as him until I need to switch. That looks like stray fairy area. Come on. Yeah, there it is. Um, and it, this is true for all Zelda games. Anytime you see something that looks out of the ordinary, um, there's probably something hidden there. So, I guess I'll go over there and get that chest. Fly over this toxic water. Can I get there? Yeah, I can. Kick it open. Ah, oh, small key. The worst item in the game. I hate small keys with a passion because every time you get up to a door that, like, you're stuck in a dungeon and every time you're like, oh, I can finally get further because you just found out, like, this super awesome trick or like you solved a riddle or a puzzle to get further and then you come to a small key door and it's like what the heck alright we're gonna um do that cause that is the I don't know I think that might be the only way to kill these things and yeah I think there's something in here going in oh that no 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 just no I'm close to the end of the video. Come on. Oh, that was... No. <laughs> Alright, you're going down, man. Ready? Oh, come on. Come on. Got him. And there'll probably be something after that. Ooh, it's a big chest. I wonder what that could be. Hopefully it'll be like some item that'll you know, help me find my way. You know, maybe like lays out the place. You know, kind of like a, uh, what is the word that I'm looking for? 
Um, kind of like a dungeon map, that's it. So yeah, we found the dungeon map. Um, it's a pretty useful uh, tool. Like if you're lost, you can um, use it to like get your get your bearings and stuff. I know where you are. Um, so I'm gonna end this video and be right back.